Python on hardware news. This is all kind of related. A lot of this stuff is Python driven. Um, so, Codebolt's community, once again, congratulations to Anne and everyone who contributes to the newsletter. We're up to 250 of them. Um, we're going to get to the large LCD displays with CircuitPython in just a second. Please, please, please check out all of the news stories and more. We even go over some of the open source certifications we recently did. ARM's IPO, that's going to have probably an impact on some of the chips and some of the things that happen to come out later on which might just run Python, um, some handy cheat sheets, not really cheating. It's just uh, figuring out what uh, what Python you need. Um, more highlights from things that are going on, tons and tons of projects. If you just want ideas for um, how to uh, get like the weather displayed on something, we have it. events that are going on in the world of Python. Events are coming back. That's kind of yeah, really cool projects. Lots of keyboards. But um, what we're going to show now is um, a quick video. This is the screen that uh is playing at circuit python that we got coming soon the, yeah. the pr is is green it's happening greetings esp friends lady ada what's this this is the esp32 s3 and this is a large 720 by 720 uh square display and uh the REPL is appearing on the display so if you back up you'll see how big it is huge display and you even see it's got the wi-fi connected it has an ip Giant. address and um one cool thing is that once you have displays working in CircuitPython, they all show up as display I.O., which means that we have example code for like displaying oh. animated GIFs. <laughs> this is an animated GIF <laughs> that's stored <laughs> on the flash. <laughs> yeah, <it's a> friend. <laughs> <laughs> and of course we can use the fonts and the graphics and you know the touch screen and all that stuff um, because it just looks like the same kind of display, whether it's an OLED or an SPI TFT. This just knows it's a gigantic 720 by 720 color display. So um, kind of neat. You just gave me a GIF, and I dragged it on, and I used GIF.io to play it, and it works great. All right. It's part of Adafruit Daily. You can go to adafruitdaily.com. It's not connected to your store account. It's a completely separate account. That way you can be sure that you'll never get spam. We don't spam. We promise. But everyone lies. So you know you should just uh, protect yourself. <laughs> you should. Everyone lies. Okay. It sucks.